morning friends welcome back to my second vlog here in mauritius please excuse that noise josh is just boiling the kettle to make some coffee it's actually quite late it is half past five we are heading out in like probably the next 15 or so minutes um i didn't really feel the need to vlog too much today because we just kind of like stayed by the resort pretty much the whole day we went on the kayaks we tanned i'm reading my book i'm loving it i'm like kind of nearing halfway well i'm actually just over halfway through and i'm like obsessed with it so really enjoying my book and i don't even know the rest of the day we just honestly took it easy but we are going somewhere fun for dinner and that's why i wanted to start recording this second vlog for mauritius now we are heading to a place i don't even know what what is it called roof i think it's called the rooftop cloud rooftop i don't know i'll make sure I'll, I'll get the name for you guys when we actually there but i think it's something like rooftop cloud or something which sounds unreal and looks unreal according to the photos so we're gonna head there for some like sunset drinks and some dinner so i'm very excited about that because obviously we've been like at the resort the whole day so it'll be nice to head out and do a little excursion i actually found these little um flowers on our bed they were making up like a little I think a swan out of the towel and I, I had it in my hair and I thought it looked quite cute but I also kind of think it look, looks a little bit like I'm really trying to get into the resort vibe you know so I don't think I'm gonna wear that but it was cute whilst I whilst I had it in my hair um but yeah it's exciting we still have another like four days so today is the 8th I think yeah today's the 8th and we're here till the 13th so we're five days um four more days at this resort and then the last day so on the 12th we actually head to like the airport hotel because we have a very early flight on the 13th so essentially we kind of have like four more days from tomorrow but still a nice amount of time to relax and recoup before the year starts but just thought i would continue recording whilst i'm here in mauritius so that i can kind of show you guys more of what we do our friends leave on tuesday so tomorrow is their last day so once they kind of head back we josh and i are going to do a few other like things here and i'll definitely take you guys along for that but yeah just want to say hello welcome back to my vlog and let's head to grand Bay for some dinner Monday so I'm kind of only starting my little vlog for today now because we honestly just had such a chill day by the pool it is I think it's like almost half past three and we are actually heading to a um I think it's like a botanical gardens type of thing it's called Pampamoose's Gardens and it has like really what does it have like turtles or tortoises turtles I think it's turtles um like lily pads and all that kind of stuff we just thought we'd do something a little bit different for the afternoon because i mean as beautiful as the pool and chill vibes are like it's also nice to do stuff and like see the island so that's what we're gonna do and then after that we're going to head back to grand bay to go have a dinner we have booked at somewhere called eden beach or eden house i'll definitely like list all these as the video goes on so you guys will definitely know what like I'm actually doing and I'm hoping to make a blog post about it as well um, but we're gonna go there for dinner for like an early dinner like sunset drinks vibes and a nice early dinner so that we can get back to the resort not too late because the couple that we're here with are heading back to Joburg in the morning so Josh and I are here until Friday they leave tomorrow which is obviously Tuesday so we don't have like too late of a night just so they can pack and get ready for um, their flight tomorrow but it's been a really beautiful day and the weather's actually like perfect it's kind of like cloudy and a bit windy but it's so needed because when it's hot it is so hot and that like wind and shade every now and then just like provides a little bit of like relief from the heat 
it's just so hot this time of year here and i'm excited to kind of explore um this like garden i don't really i will obviously vlog i don't really know exactly what we're in for but i do know we'll see quite a few cool like um i hope turtles and I don't even know, maybe birds. I'm not even too sure, but you guys will see as we do. But I'm wearing a very, very chilled outfit. I will show you guys, but it's very um, casual. Wait, Josh is just putting pants on, so let him do that. Okay, this is what I'm wearing. Just a pair of these like mom jean shorts that I got from H&M, which are a little bit longer than like I would usually wear, but I just feel very comfortable in them. And they are very comfortable to wear. And then my normal side, bodysuit and my Birkenstocks so nothing new all stuff you guys have seen which I'm gonna head in the next like five ten minutes and I will take you guys along with me we took about a half an hour taxi drive to Pamplemousse's Gardens and we actually ended up getting there about a half an hour before it closed but to be quite honest that was more than enough time it was beautiful and honestly just like some of the most incredible greenery I've ever seen. We um, saw the giant lily pads which I think if I remember correctly have been there since like the early 1800s which is crazy and the roots of a lot of the trees in Mauritius and we actually only noticed this once we had left the gardens but the roots of some of the trees actually grow outside of the earth which was just such a fascinating thing to see. We also saw a tree with the biggest root I have ever seen in my whole life like this tree was gigantic we saw tortoises as well which were very cute but it was a very hot afternoon so as i said like half an hour really was just perfect and sufficed we enjoyed it so much and it is quite an interesting excursion to do you can pay i think it was just another 75 rupees per person for a tour guide but personally we didn't really feel the need for that we enjoyed just doing it on our own and exploring and we would just ask every now and then um, someone who worked there where we could find what we were looking for but overall i would say it was a really good experience and if you feel like the need to you know go and explore a little bit more outside of um, the beaches of mauritius i think this is a, just a great activity to do we then went to dinner at a place called eden bar which for us was our favorite bar we went to whilst in Mauritius. It had the most beautiful sunset, the most beautiful views and delicious drinks, delicious food. And honestly, I would highly, highly recommend we would go back there in a heartbeat. We absolutely loved it. because tomorrow we have like until checkout at 12 and then we're actually heading to an airport hotel or like an airbnb near the airport because our flight on friday is very early so we just wanted to try and like not have to worry about a an hour and a half drive early friday morning so we are staying in an airbnb tomorrow night and just gonna take it easy and chill so it feels a little bit sad that today's our last day here in paradise um yesterday our friends went home and then we honestly it was a really rainy day so i didn't end up recording anything because we didn't do anything we actually started watching wednesday the series on netflix which is actually a really nice little end to like yesterday the evening because we didn't really want to sit in the rain and it was very windy so we had room service and just chilled and watched that so it was actually a beautiful relaxing afternoon evening um and what is the time i think it's like 20 to 10 now and i've gone and set up our little lounges at the beach so we're gonna do that today we're gonna just chill by the beach josh and i might go for like a little kayak or canoe um we'll see how we feel we want to read a lot and honestly just take today in and relax 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 because 
as I said, it's like our last full day until we kind of like start the journey back to Joburg on Friday, which is crazy. But I am quite excited to get home and back into a routine. We've been on holiday now since oh, I don't even know when. Like I feel like just before my brother got married, which was on the the 10th, I think, of December or somewhere around there. So it's gonna be quite crazy to get back into routine and like have an alarm and all that good stuff but I am very excited I do have like a whole video I'm gonna do when I get home to like update you guys on everything because I'm going home to like no job and then I have surgery and it's my birthday and then we move into Cape Town so there's a whole lot of things where I kind of want to like do a video where I talk it all through and kind of like give you guys the timeline of when everything is happening and just so we're all on the same page because at the moment I don't know if I don't know if we have done any updates on like what's coming up but um anyway we are going to as i said take it very easy today we're going to a really beautiful restaurant tonight josh and i for our, like last little romantic dinner and that's about it planned for today so i'll obviously vlog here and there but i'm not going to do too much because it's not a, it's not that much that we're doing we're just going to chill by the beach read i've finished verity and i've now started confess i'm like not even a chapter into confess just yet but i'm enjoying it so far and then i actually put on instagram story like any other recommendations for books and authors because I love Colleen Hoover, she's great, but I do need a change. <laughs> like it's been good, but I need a change in like writing and authors and stuff. So I'm excited for that because my goal, one of my goals this year, is to read two books a month. Um, and obviously I wanna like change it up. I don't wanna read the same authors over and over. So I'm glad I got some inspo on Instagram. Um, but yeah, I'm obviously wearing, wearing a very short outfit, which is like a white um, boob tube, bikini, just because I want to get like an even tan, and then some denim shorts, which you can't see, but not the end of the world. Um, and yeah, we're going to go down to the beach, read, and kind of just end this holiday off on a high. Evening guys, it is the last night. Well, it's actually the second last night, but it's the last night tonight at the resort because I think I told you already tomorrow we are gonna go to like an airport hotel kind of thing. I'm wearing a new dress I got from Zara, like literally just before we left, and I am so tan. I actually got a bit burned today on my bum, which was really weird because it was like literally like two sections and that's it which is a bit bizarre but um the sun is about to go down and i really want to get a photo in this dress i have been that person but i am that person i really want to get a photo in this dress i haven't really gotten like a an evening shot at all whilst i've been here and i really do want to get one before we leave tomorrow or the next day um i just wanted to quickly show you guys the view it's just so pretty and i'm gonna miss it so much but we don't really get the sunset here as such um but we do get, oops, sorry, we do get this like obviously beautiful, beautiful views of Mauritius, the ocean. That is actually the restaurant we're going to tonight. And um, we went there once as like a group when our friends were here. It'll be nice to go tonight as like just like a little couples thing, just Josh and I. So I'm very excited. I will take you guys down and show you what we order and all that good stuff but yeah just wanted to show you the outfit i actually haven't really even shown you so let me go show you okay this is my dress back is just dreamy it's just like cut open it's green it's like maxi length and i've got also actually zara brown shoes on and bags are being packed which is very very sad but also quite exciting to be getting 
home to routine and all that good stuff. But I'm gonna go down now so that we can take nice photos and then we're gonna head to dinner. I don't know. <laughs> it didn't look. I think that's what we're doing. I'm going to do something that's in the new place to be in the house. Okay guys, so dinner is done. It was so delish and it was a beautiful evening. As you guys could see, we literally had our table right on the water. Excuse the lighting. It's obviously quite dark in here. Um, we are exhausted. We are full. It has been a beautiful 10 days. Honestly, like dreamy and just so special. But we're also ready to go home and get back to reality. We've got so many things planned for the year and so much happening in like the first literally the first like month of the year we are heading to cape town i've got surgery it's my birthday we're moving our whole lives across the country so just so many things are happening so i think this 10 days was bliss and exactly what we needed like preparing for the mayhem that is going to be the beginning of the year um but you know when you kind of just want to get the year started and you just want to like get going i think we're both feeling that vibe at the moment but we couldn't have wished for a better holiday in mauritius and a better start to 2023 i mean if this is how it started like i can't even imagine the beautiful i don't even know adventures all the things that we're going to experience this year we're so excited but i hope you guys enjoyed the second mauritius vlog this is going to call well this is going to end call what it's going to end the whole mauritius travel series you could say um when i get back i'm definitely going to be recording some updates and a few other videos so very much looking forward to it excited to get a head start on my channel this year and to really just like push it and grow and just do the damn thing you know um but i hope you guys enjoyed it i'm really really looking forward to the year ahead and spending it with you guys so exciting love you all lots and again hope you enjoyed and i'll see you very soon bye